Oh, I don't know, since I was in a good mood, I can't think why. <laughs> Look, I even dug out your special mug. I thought you would have slung that straight in the bin. And I thought we could have um, Jenny and Nico over soon. Maybe Charity and Jay as well? Yeah, sounds good. I'm not suggesting you cook, we could get a takeaway or... I think I could manage a roast. Thank you. You really don't need to try this hard, you know. Really? Yes. Uh, sorry to interrupt, Tony. There's some bloke in the office whittling on about livery. So he's made an appointment? Oh, he's early. Can you please keep that warm for me? Well, no, there's no need, because Nicola can show him round, can't you? I, no, I can't. I work for you, not Katie. <sighs> yeah, but she found you so useful. I don't think she can manage without you. Uh, I think I can. So I've extended your job description. From now on, you work for both of us. Off you pop. She does? They will do. But you won't need me, will you? Where's Declan? Uh, it's on the phone outside. You looking for something? No. Only I'm pretty sure that's confidential and Declan's very particular about who can see what. But maybe he used to be. Until he tells me otherwise, I've got a duty of confidentiality to my employer. Tell Declan I'll be back after lunch. Yeah. Yes, my lady. <laughs> <laughs>